one of the world's best, one of the world's greatest. You know, you he hits it with pace, it's round the wall, it's on the money, and once it hits the surface, the goalkeeper's literally stranded, which he was. We've got a game of 20 and 20 in his two previous seasons here at Al Nasser, and he's got six in seven appearances here. This is going to be the uh, aerial view of the header by Ronaldo. I think he knew that himself, there was no argument of that. It goes again. Goalkeeper in two minds that time. Now he retreats. No harm done for Al Nasser, but the threat remains. Been clearly put to bed because Kudu, he's got to get his eyes up and fixate what the goalkeeper's doing. His miles off his line. That's lovely by Ronaldo to Teres. Oh, he gets a great cross. Ooh, he's got another dangerous area. Free kick at the range. What's going to happen? Anything out, Lee? I really wouldn't. Ronaldo, it is. Take a bow. Take a bow, Ronaldo. But the Talisca one. Oh, this one. Well, again. When you've got the goalkeeper guessing what's going to happen, he doesn't go for pace, he goes for sheer class. Look at the technique on that, Paul. It's top bin, just drops below the top bin. But a treat, what a treat for the crowd, what a treat for his coach Castro. What a treat. And he outmatches everybody. Don't ever. Maybe that little tweak and change in formation yes. and style. Sometimes not even being involved in games, but I think that's when top class it rises and he just produces. He gets four and he turned nicely. Just one or two little reminders to that back line of Al Nassau, which has been so porous today. I don't think just today. I think the game against Saba as well, they were so exposed, so wide open. Taliska. Shafai might just escape another card. We're here. And remember, they've been so free scoring after the first couple of weeks of the campaign. 33 goals before today in nine. Poor quality to go and really put that sucker punch in and put this game to bed. The big wins. Came against Al Fata 5-0. Whatever the magic ingredient is here, he seems to love it. I think he needs his point in. Raced away down the touchline to appeal for a free kick as the game goes on the other way. It was Tellers who came away with it. with a little look over his shoulder there. Maybe expecting a tap on the shoulder. This deal and Endo has been two fabulous well work free kicks that have got them back in this game and got them leading. So you, know, you do feel that certainly Damak have had opportunities. And again they work it nicely. Al Zayin. Child. Well in the first instance anyway. But clumsy in the challenge. Looked like a coming together, didn't it? I think. He's got to come. Around the corner by Antonic. Hamid moves it on. Sancho further to the left. For Alan Azani. Sancho blocked away by Taliska strides forward and nobody quite strides forward like Fafana to appear I feel that they will eventually start to appear and a potential two on one on this side Tell and there might be a little bonus immediately in that Al Nasser back line. And defending's going to be so crucial. Just advising him not to. There's some place for Najar to deal with. 
Bielefeld. Only started once this season. But they're making their own lives a bit more complicated at the back again. Al Nasser. Stopped by Al Amri. Damak apparently still believe. So can Stanchu deliver? He tries to do so. Wasn't a bad one. 